What's up, YouTube? So right now I'm uploading a badass calzone video to my desktop. Um, yeah, this is what it looks like, or what half of it looks like. I've been eating on it, and holy shite, is it good. Look at that beautiful cross-section. I was filming it earlier, and I was like, yeah, I'm just going to redo this, this part of it, I guess. Yeah. But you should have seen it. Like, I cut the sucker in half, put a half slice on my plate. Big enough for both hands, I shit you not. And I'm like, I'm getting foolish to stop eating this, but I just kept on eating it and eating it. Dude, this is really good. Uh, this breakfast calzone kicks Asperger's. Hold up. Mm. I literally ate half of, almost half of it in one sitting. That's nuts. I mean, I should be putting this down, because, um, hmm. But this breakfast calzone is so dank, I can't put it down. I may end up eating the entire half in one sitting, and that's no bullshit. Now you saw me cut it in half in my last video. It got up to that point. I had a couple things to say left and did that. Oh, okay, yeah, I'm typing out. <laughs> I'm gonna put this up back on that piece of stone. I'm gonna dry my hands, YouTube. One second. The cheese pull I had while I was eating that earlier, not too shabby. Got a couple things done off camera in between the cooking video and trying it. Uh, I had a couple dishes in the sink that needed to be washed. I almost made it through half of that calzone in one sitting because it was that good. But now that I ate almost one whole half, I'm just like instantly like, oh dude, that's... <sighs> I could keep eating, but I'm like, no, I'm starting to get full one. You gotta stop yourself at that point because once you start, it's gonna make your tummy hurt if you eat too much. So, and you know. Most excellent. Most bloody excellent. The video is importing. It's almost there. Come on. Come on, you bastard.
to the desktop. Oh, it's so close. So bloody close. Come on, almost there. After consuming almost a whole half of that calzone, now I'm watching it just slowly but surely creep along. Come on, you bastard. Freaking upload, huh? So close yet so far away. you hurry come on I'm very impatient when it comes to my videos uploading that's about the only thing I'm impatient with really is that urge to just deliver content yeah. come on upload you bastard you can do there one little bit left to go come on there you go you little shit come on come on so close come on do it do it to the desktop come on to the desktop you go there it goes Now it's on my desktop, I can delete it from my phone. Uploads video. This is what they would call a breakfast calzone. Breakfast calzone. There's a couple of recipes here and there on YouTube, you know, different takes on it, and that's what makes cooking awesome, is there's different ways to do things, you know. People be sitting there saying, well, this is how you do a burger, or this is how, well, that's your way to do it. As long as your beef and your pre-cookables are properly cooked, then, eh, <coughs> holy, oh, this is ridiculous. I don't stay up this late on the weekend unless the cooking videos would be the only exception. This is going to help YouTube grow as a website. Because <sighs> now people are going to be going, Breakfast Calzone. Say what? Go put it in the cooking video. 
Nah, -uh. you can't wait, dude. You don't even know. This dude loaded so much goodness. Do you want to see what the half looks like before I eat it all? Because I got it on the pizza stone, and I reckon that pizza stone's cool off enough that I can pick it up with my bare hands and be like, here's what the final product looks like. Just in case you didn't get the camera angles you were craving on that cooking video. And sure, I could have cooked the beef and the bacon separately and just cook the egg it would have sped up the cooking video but I'm like that takes the fun out of it like, I mean look look at it YouTube it's uh, glorious you can kind of see it spilling out on the side just a little bit there. But, you know, comparatively speaking, here's my hand. And looks like one half just about as big as my hand, if not a little bit bigger. This, this is how you make a calzone, you two. Now I'll get to cooking that uh, breakfast burger for my next cooking video right after I get done eating the rest of that calzone which will be off camera of course you know I don't snack on camera all the time unless I'm reviewing a product or making a cooking video I feel like just casually snacking while you do a video I mean I'd, I've done it before, but yeah. Oof. Probably the healthiest thing of that entire meal was the water I'm drinking. Like, that's no shit. If you want to cook like a boss, simple recipes that are filling, delicious, and full of flavor, and relatively cheap to make. That's the kind of recipes people are looking for. Ain't nobody got time to do a 12-hour course meal. I like, guess just ridiculous. Preparing that would take for forever. You know what I'm saying? So like, yeah, no, if you're gonna cook something, you want it to be like minimum three hours, maximum three hours, minimum like one hour to like 15 minutes or less. You know, that's, that's the kind of recipe that people are looking for. That banana bread recipe I made, it was quick, easy to make. A calzone I made, take a bit more time to make, but the calzone takes a bit longer to make, but I tell you what, YouTube, I tell you what, it was worth it. I'm sitting there munching on this half, like, oh, this is so, and then right there at the end, I was like, oh. Well, technically it was Saturday when I made this, but I got home right as midnight approached. Oof. Burn it to midnight oil to deliver to you, YouTube, a delicious cooking video. I want to wrap this video up so this one doesn't take that long to upload. 
I'm going to make some pipe tobacco because that was an exquisite calzone. It's not authentic Italiano, you know, classic, yeah, but, uh, you know, it's the next best thing. I mean, like, you got no experience. You know what I'm saying? You got no experience making them. Just kind of like, okay, you know, ingredients at the store, you know. It's okay, you know. And you might have some people out there who, they come from out of state and they're just like, you call this a calzone? The fuck is this pre-made pizza dough shit? And I'm like, eh, hey, well, it's the best we can do around here. Like, well, no, let me. And then he just goes to the store and he buys the ingredients to make the dough himself. And he's like, this is how you do it. Now, that recipe took damn near two hours to make. Now, let's add 43 minutes on top of that just to make the pre made dough. So, I mean, you know, if you're crunched for time and, you know, if you're making something in the morning, that's a pretty hardy way to start out your day. But let me tell you, it takes a minute to make. And it's, you know, you know. That calzone just looked like heart failure on a plate, but that's why it tasted good. <clears throat> Time to saw some logs, catch some Z's, and catch your cool cobras on the flip side. That calzone was dank. You already know what's up, though. Well, tubes, I'll catch you all on the next one on the real note, because it's late. I didn't mean to stay up this fucking late to, just for a couple of videos, but eh, it's the weekend. Get out there and cook something, you know. If one thing... I want for my cooking videos, I want it to inspire people to want to cook, you know, to get other people into it and be like, oh, hey, you know, you want to sit there and say the recipe's gross or it looks like shit, that's your opinion. I'll catch you cool copers later though.